This film took, as I said, five years to make. My goal was to make you feel like you've been to Jerusalem. At the crossroads of history, forged by centuries of conflict, is a place once believed to be the center of the world. Direct from Jerusalem, Farah, Revital, and Nadia. You get to see it in a way that you couldn't as a tourist. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity for people to explore Jerusalem through the eyes of Jewish, Christian, and Muslim young people. I think what's special about Jerusalem is that you can see all those different kinds. I love every part of the city because every stone has a story to tell. You, you are inside Jerusalem for real. Maybe for the first time. It kind of gives you a head rush and it's kind of um, overwhelming. Like it kind of like makes you feel like you're there. It was very inspiring and it opened my eyes up to a totally new culture. It was beautiful. So this exhibition, The Sultans of Science, is representing the scientific and technological advancements that happened during the golden age of science in the Islamic world from the 6th to the 16th century. That's what we're showcasing here. It's about the history of science. Areas of science that we know very little about because we don't realize that the roots of all of our activities in chemistry, medicine, astronomy, that they have these roots that go back into this period of time. It's so, it's so advanced for the time and I find it so amazing. There's a lot of interactive activities for different people, adults, little kids. Not only to look at our history, but to get inspirations from it. The film Jerusalem and the exhibition Sultans of Science teach us about our roots. It's indeed about science, indeed, but it's also about history, but also understanding why great civilizations flourish. 